All right, we're back. This is MTG Bros. What's up, what's up? With the two bros. With my first um, collector's legends, number yes. six in the box. Yeah, tell the backstory about this one. Okay, so obviously you knew that we had a case. So there was one, two, three, four, five, six. MTG Bro took five, right? And then so, I ended up selecting, it turned out, I think I selected three, four, two, three, four. I selected two, three, four. And um, you were like, hey, let's split it up. So, I, tra I traded you number three for number six. So, then I ended up with two, four, six. And you ended up with one three five, unintentional. Yep. Unintentional. Yeah, we just did it by peer. So this is the one I traded. So either I traded for a god box or I traded away the god box. So we will find out. We're gonna do yes. number six, and MTG Pro will do number three, the one I traded, and then we'll see. It's always really interesting. And then we'll see who got the better box. All right, so without further ado, let's crack in. Release the Kraken right here. See, I'm releasing the Kraken on the play map. Oh, yeah. So it's like that theory we always talk about. You know, mm -hmm. if, if you open it, don't think you never know. If you open this, it's a better maybe you didn't open it. Yep. We'll find out what would have happened. So right here, cast your commander style, new edge foil, found in every collector booster, blah blah blah, two. So you get two foil edge cards. You get three foil edge cards. It says, contains two. Don't you get three? Yeah, you get three for sure, three. Two extended art cards, ten foils, a foil token up to five mythics. Your commander deck has never looked so luxurious. Okay, so, um... Yeah, it's weird. You, I'm pretty sure you get like a mythic, a rare, and a rando, like an uncommon or common. Yeah, yeah. So, anyways, I do like the foiling on this, the the packs and the box is really cool. Look at that. They're gonna run out of colors. Yeah, just start recycling, obviously. But um, the these packs, these foil on the packs look sweet. Look at that. Cause the um the the core and stuff is just cr and Zendikar is just like chrome. This thing's like all all foil, luxurious. All right, hold on. This is fifteen. On a normal pack, you get twenty, don't you? Yeah. So you get shorted, or what? I don't know. Okay. All right. All right. Whatever. All right. Let, without further ado, let's go. My first pack, crack. Lotus. Look at this bend. Rock has been bent. <laughs> this is the one. See this one? Oh yeah, the. Yeah, the so that's the same problem I had. So we got the dragon mantle. Her head is just the, literally ex the disappearing head, floating head. Yep. <laughs> It's like, it looks like it's just separating. Elvish. So let's go. So these are the uncommons. This is a rare. No, this is uncommon. It's hard to tell sometimes. If you're looking like from above, it looks gold. So we got... Are there any good uncommons? Bless you. So Sats will... Very, um, the foiling you can tell right here, but on the the actual card, it's hard to tell. Do you see any foiling going on? Nope. Yeah, right. Not much. So then we got Temporic Expansion, Nightshade Harvester. So then we're into the um, etched Glacial Power Stone, Skyrider, and a rare Obek Brute Chronologist. Alright. Those are all not good, I don't think. Nothing that I recognize, so. 
Let's go with. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Okay, so we got a fact or fiction. Uncommon. That's weird. You get an uncommon. Um, full art. Looks cool though. Fact yeah, or fiction. Then we got a uh, itch tekik salvage splicer. Looks like the Borg. Then we got a Kagi Sky Warden command beacon. This is worth something, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, it's like four bucks for the regular. What is that? It's like a foil. Yeah, foil. And then we got an arcane signet. Not foil. Oh, we got a, melf, a mythic Hellkite Courser. Then we get, we're into the the um the foils. The etched. Okay. Look at that. You get you have foiling inside the pack. Foil on foil. My etched is Togo Goblin Weapon Smith Zedru, Zedru the Great Hearted. It's the freaking Minotaur Monk Goat Head. These are probably not worth much. What's the mythic? That's the mythic, the goat guy. The Great Hearted. Alright, let's go. All edge stuff is not good anyway, so. I mean, they're worth something. All right, we got a uh, soul of eternity. Leave f elves and austere command. All right, and then we got the etched right there. Rovos, soul tender as the mythic. Yeah, they're not worth much. Yeah. Guildless Commons. Hmm. Alright, so we got Victimize for the box topper. Nadir. No. Nope. Bio Waste Blob. What? Oh, that's a bug. I can't even, like, figure out this box. It's so confusing. Another one. Fact or fiction? Like, uh, try figure out like how many box toppers you can get for bugs and stuff. Yeah. Really Keeper of the Cord. Whoa. The Krom Luvik Opius. K-R-A-U-M. Luvik Opius. Krom? How do you spell that? K-R-A-U-M. So far, this has been pretty cold. You got lucky. You got rid of this. Could be a couple bucks. Still early, man. Okay, we got a Commander Sphere. Sashkama okay, Protege. It's like a buck. Okay, so we got a Imperial Tactician. Bird Wizard as the mythic. The last U. That's pretty bad. Man, this is not good. No. Oh, we got a crown. Maybe that's a sign of good things to come. The monarch. All right, let's go. Let's go. Jekka's will for rare. Three visits. Magus of the Order. Oh. Oh, Rakdos, Lord of the Riots, as of, as of etched. Okay, three bucks for the Jessica's Will. Uh, Rakdos. It's probably worth a buck or two. Man, that is bad. That is bad. We already went through one side. Uh, okay, this side's going to be really good then. Yeah. We need to hit something. Rakdos, man. Court of Grace. As the box topper. Oh, Reliquy Tower. Elv 
Elvish Dreadlord. So no hits. Elvish, uh, Court of Grace is like uh, four or five bucks. Dude, this is bad. This is bad. I'm getting excited about like uh, the Rail Tree Tower. I'm not getting excited. I just thought it looked cool. What is this one? A common land as a box topper. What is that? Terramorphic Expanse. How is that even good? Hey, hey I got to Give me a second. Hey, pause it? Yeah. What? All right, so what is it? Terramorphic Expanse is a common. Yeah, like 50, 50 Why did they do that? Seraphic oh, Greatsword cool. is a mythic oh. foil. That looks cool. That's like a bug. Dude, look at this. <laughs> Flagbag Marauder. Why? I don't remember you getting commons. Flagbag. Dawn, Dawn Glad Regent as the rare. Xenos, God of Reveals. I, already got, I got that one last time. Ooh, legendary creature, Armoreth, the Lustrious. So we got a god, okay. Still sucky. I better get a, um, a Lotus. Mana Drain, at least. Oh, yeah, Mana, mana Drain, full art. Let's go. Okay, Junk. Flamekin Herald. Boros Charm. Come on, what the heck? Aurora Phoenix. The Phoenix is cool. Seeker Adept. Nah, let's not look at those. We got three more, so we're just going to blow through these and we're going to... Hope for the best. Last pack. They call it Last Pack Miracle. I don't know. Nightshade Harvester. Nope. Or Opal Palace. Ooh, Neville's Disc. Worth a couple of cents. Oh, nice. I like the art. Queen. Ooh, Cool. Queen Marchesa from what is this? What's this called? Um, conspiracy. That sounds familiar. Yeah. Singir the Dark Baron. This one might be worth a buck or two. Yeah, Queen Marchesa. That's a cool, cool one. Last two. Yep. Alright, here we go. Generous gift. Not so generous. Junk. Junk. Another Phoenix. Soul Ring. Soul Ring. Underground Stadium. That must be worth something. Alright, last pack. So. Yeah, Undergrowth Stadium. Alright, so. Yeah. Foil? No, non foil. Oh, okay. Foil would have been like 40. Non foil is like 14. Alright, well, we're, we're not doing good anyway, so. It's all good. Come on. Preordain. Whoa, Sphinx of the Second Sun. Sphinx. Their favorite. Other than that, bah, wah, wah. Thanks to the second sun is seven for non-foil, twenty-three for foil. Seven. So let's see. How many box toppers do we get? Underground is good. Soul ring is cool. <laughs> Neverose disc. Opal palace. Come on. Why did you? Why did they put commons? Reliquy tower. I knew three visits. There's a bunch of. I mean, the artwork is cool. So three visits. That sounds cool. Yeah, but it's uncommon. I think. Arcane Signet is pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, Alright. Four bucks. For three visits. Four. Oh, six. Oh, six bucks? Okay. Yeah, so there's a there's probably a lot of cards we overlook. But I mean, we're looking for the big, big yeah. bucks. So far, no big hitters. Let's see. How many um box toppers did we get? You either get a box topper or or a full yeah, rare. How many? I didn't count mine. One, it's like, two. It's just so confusing. 
confusing with commons and uncommons. It's like hard to tell what's what. I got nine box toppers. Uncommons, uh, rares. This uncommon, rare, rare, common, <laughs> uncommon, rare, rare. So made it like extra gamble now because before they would all be yeah. rares. So these are just like these ones. Look, there's this is a common, rare, uncommon, rare, common, rare, uncommon, rare. There's commons in here. I mean, some uncommons are probably worth money, so. Because look, the f this is like the new um, what's it called the landward elves. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So it's playable and it looks cool. Yeah. yeah. So in this slot, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten rares. Uncommons. One, two, three, four, five, six uncommons. Soul ring is cool. And Reliquy Tower is cool. Tower. Boros Charm, probably worth, used to be worth something. Three Visits, Factor Arcane Fiction, Tower. Arcane Signet. Tower. Tower's like a buck something. Uh, what's that? Boros Charm? Yeah. Yeah, I think that used to be worth something. Is it a promo? Yeah. Yeah, $2-ish. This card was high for a bit, I remember. Yeah. So, you get one rare myth uncommon, it seems like. Okay. In the, in the foil section. That thing messes me up, man. I don't know how to, like, what slots what. Like, before, you know, you get... I know you get commons on commons, but inside the commons on commons is like mix now. Mm -hmm. And then the rare, and then what? I'm, I don't know. I'm it goes like, I think it goes like the, the normal stuff. Then after, then you hit the, the box topper or, you know, the full art section. Yeah. The full art section, you can also get just the foil rare. And then the last slot is the the foil the these um etched yeah i'm gonna have to watch where the lotus can show up yeah we haven't got anything good yet this queen one is cool i like it other than that pretty junk pretty much junk so i i sorry i got your sacrificial um box it took one for the teeth now if um if you open like a lotus then you win oh. You win. I just hope, honestly, mm -hmm. like, at least one, you know, both of us can open one. That's all I hope. Well, I mean, I don't even care about a Lotus as long as it's a good, a good card. You know, it could yeah. be, it could be anything. Mana Drain. You Ma got the one in the Masters. Yep. It could be Mana Drain. It could be anything as long as it's good. Yeah. I'm not picky. Uh, Vampire Tutor. Cool Cause look at all these mythics you get, you get a lot of mythics. It's not mythical. But the cards are are pretty cool. I mean, I, I like the look and everything. I like the look. It's it's cool. It's different. Okay. Um, would it be cooler if it was like a full art etched foil? That would be pretty cool. But yeah, yeah I think they'll work their way towards that. Yeah, but definitely these cards, these cards make it special, you know, like, you never seen an edge foil before, so, and they seem to be pretty, made pretty well, you know, I don't see, um, the any, foils, yeah, the, the edge foils are, look pretty nice, high end, yeah, they look pretty good, haven't been pringling yet, a little pringling going on, but, Let's give it all right. You'll other, see. other than that, this was pretty underwhelming, um, but we got more to come. I still, we still got more to open, so I'm not down. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 
All right. So remember, um, we still have that giveaway going on. So be sure to check out the first unboxing video of the Commander Legends Collectors. You can get information on that. I think, how long do we have still going? We're going to keep it for another, at least a week, a week and a half. All right. Cool. So go on over there, make a comment, and good luck. Good luck. And like keep, and subscribe. And keep on cracking. Unless crackin'. unless you get a junk box like this, then um, don't, don't retire. <laughs> yeah, yeah it, it probably would be worth more um, clothes. Unless something spikes. You never know. You never know, like Nether Shadows just spikes. Yeah, that card's crazy. I don't know who's buying that one out. Yeah. Cool. I think that it's because the card is amazingly good. It is. Yeah. I play it. The artwork, the artist. Oh, yeah. yeah you're never going to get the art again. Yep, true that. True that. All right, well, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next time.